guys welcome back to my channel so today we're gonna talk about easy cop part so I bought easy cop part last week and tried using it on easy 350 release and top so I was able to cop like five pairs as you can see here so I'm gonna do a quick overview on easy cop part starting from the general overview like if you guys have been using any bot or is it like first time using a bot so easy cop bot is a just food such dedicated bot like you can only run food sites on easy cop but like right now in the market easy cop is one of the best food sites bot with high success ratio so as you can see here like you can like run foot locker foot action champs east bay kids foot locker foot locker canada so that are all sites that has been supported by easy cop right now and as you can see the overview it's like simple task profiles proxies and cop and settings so we're gonna go uh, go through like each of the thing so talking about task so task means creating a task for your bot to run on so right here you can see create task so you can create a task choose what side you want to run if you want to run foot locker then run foot locker then skew then whatever size you want to run then choosing the profile and proxy list how many tasks and also you can schedule your task so that's how you can create your uh, task for your bot moving forward to profiles so here you can create a profile so we're going to create a task profile so let me write down like this just a task for task so you can see here then your delivery info Just writing whatever I can, and here you, you can see like CP or like York and Y. So here you can select like shipping info and billing info the same, or you can change your billing info. Also, you can select here like how many pads you wanna cop like how many pairs you wanna do so here you can see like if you wanna do one per skew then once then many so once it, if your profile gets successfully copped like any one pair then it will stop all the tests but many it will be like running as many as does take it can so we press create or uh, So here we, we have created a test profile moving forward to proxies so here you can add proxies like by creating list you can write down whatever name you prefer then pasting your proxies here and press create so all of your proxies will be shown over here and you can select the list like you can create multiple lists and select whatever proxies you want to use you can also add proxies to the list that you have selected and clear all proxies and can use like delete option to delete that proxy list and at last comes the cop so here you can see as i told you i ran this part for 350 release and i was able to cop like five pairs so here you can see your success and moving towards the last option settings so here you can attach your webhook uh, you can select your manual sound and here is the license thing and if you want to deactivate then you can deactivate your bot over here so let's try to create a task and run like a test task so 
like you guys can come to know like how does it work so here i press create test and I'm, i'll be running foot locker and on the side you can see the skew in the bottom right here i'm copying that skew pasting over here random size taking test profile local ip one task and create so here is like one of our fast task creator and let me run it so right here so right now food cells are using data dome so we're gonna sort of captures so it's been verified again verify retrying adding to cart so let's see what happens wait data dome So Foots has been using data dome like from the mocha releases and it's for the last release like foot that's were too hard like you just keep on solving captures and that's all you you are doing uh, if you're running bot that's what I did like in the last 350 release so still so I'm gonna cancel it out so right here it says we're waiting for data dome so here you can pressing this button you can stop your task then press on log button to check like the logs of your task and at last if you want to edit your task like during a release like if you want to change queue or profile or whatever so you can edit here and if you want to delete task so press this thing and it will be deleted so basically this was the fast overview of from me like for the easy cop bot if you guys like it retails for $600 right now but if you're any cook group like many of the cook groups are having like a group buys right now that's how I got it so if you're in any good group, cook group and have, like if they are having any group buys then I'll suggest to buy this bot like if you're trying to get into botting and just focusing on food sites yeah basically that was it so if you're using any other bots or uh, if you're using easy cop bot and you have any more suggestions comments on it do write down in the comment section below if you like this video then do press that like button and subscribe to my channel for more of the videos like i post live cops every week uh, then i also post videos of unboxing as well as some guides so yeah you if you like my channel then do subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching